So in this problem, we're told that a farmer wants to fence an area of 37.5 million square feet in a rectangular field and then divide it in half with a fence parallel to one of the sides of the rectangle. What should the lengths of the sides of the rectangular field be so as to minimize the cost of the fence? So let's just first try and draw a diagram of what they're asking us. So we have a rectangular field, and so this is the lines are basically the fence, and then it says divide it in half with a fence parallel to one of the sides of the rectangle. So basically, this is what it's going to look like. And so what I'm going to try and use is um, different variables to represent this. So let's just say that this side is going to be equal to y, this whole length right here, and then each of these are going to be equal to x. And so if we were trying to find the area of this, we know that x, this side, times this side, which is y, is equal to our area. They tell us what the area is. It's 37,500,000. And so now what we want to do is solve for one of our variables um, because it's going to make it easier. So if we go ahead and do that, let's just solve for y. So we know that y is going to be equal to 37 million. 500,000 divided by x. So I'll show you why we did this. So if we want to try and find the perimeter. We can represent that um, by adding up all the sides. So x plus x plus x is 3x. Then y plus y is going to be 2y. That's going to be equal to our perimeter. So what we want to do now is plug in what we solve for y into this. And then we'll go from there. So if we plug in this, we'll have 3x plus 2 times 37,500,000 over x. And then that's going to be equal to our perimeter. But So let's just go ahead and solve. So 3x and then 2 times 37,500,000 is 75 million. So we have 3x plus 75 million uh, over x. But I'm just going to write that as 75 million times x to the minus 1. So this is basically uh, this just represented with um, only x's. And then so what we want to do now is um, we're going to find the derivative of this and then set it equal to 0 and solve for x. So what is going to be the derivative of this? Well, the derivative of 3x is just 3. Then now we need to find the derivative of 75 million times x to the minus 1. So what we do is just move our minus 1 down so it's going to become 3 minus 75 million times x to the, and then we subtract 1, so x to the minus 2. But I'm just going to write this as um, over x squared. It's the same thing. And so what we want to do is set this equal to 0 and then solve. So if we move 3 to the other side, we'll get minus 75 million over x squared is equal to minus 3. And then so let's multiply both sides by x squared. Then we'll get minus 75 million is equal to minus 3x squared. And then if we divide both sides by minus 3, this is going to give us 25 million. So 25 million equals x squared. So uh, now we can solve for one of our sides. If we just uh, square root both sides, uh, that's going to cancel. And then the square root of 25 million is just 5,000. So x is going to be equal to 5,000. So to minimize the cost of the fence, this should be one of the sides. So this side right here is going to be 5,000. But we need to find the other side. So we know that one's 5,000, but we need to find the other. So let's just take this number and plug it into this. So y is going to be equal to 37,500,000 divided by 5,000. So if you do that in your calculator, you should get that uh, it's going to be equal to 7,500. So our two values are going to be 5,000 and 7,500. And so what we want to do is put our smaller value first. So 5,000 and then 7,500. And so these are going to be the answers to this question.